the developer tab. In this lesson, we're going to look at how to switch on the developer tab. The reason why we're switching on the developer tab is one of the tools we need. The spin button is found within the developer tab. So how do we switch it on? If you go to your file tab on your ribbon, you come down to your options. That then brings up the Excel options dialog box. In here, we're looking for the customize ribbon section. And it's under the customize ribbon option, you'll see under your main tabs, you'll see an option here for the developer. So I'm gonna tick the option here for developer and click okay. And straight away, you can see you've got a new tab that's been added to your ribbon. Now it's the only thing we're gonna be using it for, for the spin button. Uh, generally, if you were doing um, macros and VBA, you would use this developer tab, but really the only reason we need it is to get at some of the controls that exist. So you can see I've got the developer tab and I've grouping here called control and the buttons that I'm going to use are found under the form controls here, but we'll look at that in the next lesson.